Yes, this is the condition hope by Dumfries this morning. After seeing this condition, I have to call the liaison, of, liaison officer, Mr. Downey, and also the member of parliament for Eastern St. Thomas, Dr. Mitchell Charles. And I explained to them about this terrible condition and they gave me assurance that they're going to get in touch with the personnel who are in charge of this section of the road. And so I waited on them to make those calls. Um, within an hour, they called back to say that they get in touch with those people and that they're going to come and do some work. So they came back in the afternoon and did some work. But, but what happened? It is not finished, so they decided that they're going to come back tomorrow, which is Saturday and Sunday, and continue working on the road. So this is just what the road was like this morning, because in the morning it takes so long from point A to point B. It takes you 30 minutes or 40 minutes from license from Johnstone Crossing to Town Capital, which is Maran Bay. And this condition could not go on forever. Right. Look at the condition of this is just a section of the road leading from Murphy to Prospect. This is just a condition of this section from Murphy to Prospect. This is all by license to the Princess Margaret Hospital. Huh? Man, yeah, I, I people are gonna work late too early, you know? Because when people are working at o'clock, they reach at 9 o'clock. So it don't really work. You know, them even from there to out there, so, but it's a short distance for just take a week and fix. Yeah. So I don't know what really happened, if there's a problem or what I'm doing. We're blocking. Yeah, we're blocking. Blocking. Yeah, man, the road is good with good. Mass, man. How long you suffer? Three, three years now we suffer now. Why oh, road the boss, man. They look good. Yeah, man. Yeah, Kurt Brown, President, Eastern St. Thomas Taxi Association. Um, yeah, we are right here in the location of Dumfries. Um, this corridor of road been under construction for some years now. And it, it's real terrible at this time to be dealing with this um, condition of the road. And we are appealing to the contractor, especially the, pre, the, the current contractor, to do something about it. Because as you notice, we, the operator, the taxi and the bus operators, you know, it's it, it, it creating a big impact on our business. And we can't take it anymore. So we are pleading to the relevant authority, the contractor, for this leg or this corridor of road improvement right here in St. Thomas, Dumfries, Lysa, to do something about it, urgent, because you know, it's not looking good. So we are really... You know, especially we are in the, the, the festive season right over the corner. So, you know, we really need to see some improvement urgently. And so, the prices were heard and they're out there now trying to get some work done in the afternoon. So this is the same section that was shown earlier out by license St. Thomas. Right, so they're out there now trying to get some work done. So, this is just to show that sometimes we need to speak but we need to go out there and let our voices be heard. Good evening to all the residents of Eastern St. Thomas. Let me say to you that the Lord is good and this is the day that the Lord has created. Let us rejoice and be glad in it because he is the King of all kings and he is the Lord of all Lord. He answers to our cry. I know from the other day when we have in the, the recent heavy rains in terms of the movement of traffic from all the way from the town all the way to as far as to, to a license it has been a major challenge for all road users and I do want to apologize on behalf of the member of parliament Dr. Michel Charles as the liaison officer to see that everything goes correctly. Yes, we would have been out there much earlier than we anticipated, but the rains came and the rains came 
and you know to put on soil base soil in the rain it would have just washed away to one side nevertheless there were huge patholes and you know it was to the call you know from mr anderson from this famous you know radio station and class and clarity and he did let me apologize clarity and he did you know he was in the traffic and he said Downey, boy it's really bad i was in the traffic for a good while now a couple of hours now and i don't even reach anywhere near martley i did make an urgent appeal to my dear member of parliament dr charles which in a very quick response i must say thanks to greg who supervised through mr anderson from the check and the greater driver and all those who came in in, in in as quick as possible i just want to say thanks to beverly and you know rasta rasta lady my two flag persons always when i call them on emergency they would have been there you know and i just want to say to the residents that problem that you are facing will be a thing of the past we will commence work tomorrow with base soil and you know to put a proper base soil and then you'll get your final product i can guarantee you that i know that you know you have exercised a lot of patience my dear residents and users of the road and you know it will be a thing of the past very 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 soon you will see the end product we are working as quick as possible to alleviate all the challenges that you have where it comes to the road and enter into the town and beyond the town from the either end i want you to have a blessed day please stay dry please stay safe take your time on the road i know the rain is, the rain has not ceased i want to all the real road users to remember to just exercise caution as you use the thoroughfare you know be very careful love you all love you eastern center of us people love you god bless you we are all jamaicans god bless you all so that was the voice of mr downey the late officer for the road in the eastern section of St. Thomas. So man, we soon start to talk man. We know man, we know man. <laughs> Call him up. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Make him go to go make him go to Alright, going back in line now. Alright, yeah. Any man cut the line, any man cut the line today, may I catch them? Yeah, any man cut the line today. Think I'm joking thing. Any man cut the line today, may I catch them? No cut the line today. Any man cut it today, may I catch them? Think I'm joking thing. Go on now.
I'm not ball, so I'm not pulling up a cut line. They're my ball. Come, come now. Come now, come now. Yeah! Come down, fire, come down, fire. Nothing good now going up there. That's where you go, your uncle. Ah, oh, uncle. Go back in there, go back in there, go back in that line, go back in that line! In that line if you go back in that line. Go back in that line, go back in that line, go back in that line, man. In that line if you go back in that line. Oh, go back in that line, go back in that line, in that line, in that line if you go back in that line. Don't cut the line. I don't me out of it today. Yes, sir. I me out of it today. What are you doing? Video and walk out the line. Oh. Yeah. No cut in a line today, nobody cut a line today and get away. Anybody cut a line today get catch funny. Think I joke it. Fire. <laughs> when you client start we'll come here you now. Can I regulate that? May I regulate this? I regulate this. Yo, you're not playing the way to the manual. Trust me, I know, yo. <laughs>